What's up, guys? It's your Dr. MPX, and we're back with another episode of Achievement Border Expansion. So, today, I would actually like to be not living in the cave anymore. <laughs> so, we're going to move to that spot where we place the nether portal, and we're going to start actually building our house. So, I would like to build the house, and maybe, maybe if we have enough time, we'll visit uh, the hellscapes that is uh, the nether and try to fix uh well you know from the other episode oh this is terrible oh this is terrible oh my god no way yeah so that needs to be fixed <laughs> i want to make it at least a little bit safer uh just because it's in a terrible position currently uh, so we need to make it so that I won't die so easily or we'll get pushed into the lava. <laughs> we'll make it very basic and maybe in a, a future episode we might update the design or something. You know, when I'm when I'm feeling braver, braver way braver. <laughs> but for now, let's get started with moving. So, ooh, hello B. Uh, let's grab some stuff from here. Let's just mine these all out. Got to take them anyway, so let's take them. Uh, which one will we fit? Oh, we're going to have to do a couple of... Okay, well, we can do this one since it's got mildly less stuff in it. And we'll fill this with as much stuff as we can. Nice. All right. So that's in. I'll just change this out for that. Oop. Already getting stuck. <laughs> alright, so let's make our way over there. Lucky it's not too far. So that's alright. We don't have to do too it's not too long of a trip to get to get there to and from. Uh See if we can gra grab any achievements in this episode as well. Maybe a few nether ones while we're while we're in there. Just see if we can find a fortress, get our bearings, you know. Just have a look around. See what's up. I am very excited for what we can be doing with uh, that village though. We could do actually a few achievements or advancements with uh, with this village. Let me know in a future uh episode if you would like me to actually incorporate this village into uh, what we de decide to design in here. Uh, so let's just get rid of a few, few of these. So there we go. All right, so let's place down the chest. Uh, let's just place it here, I guess. Place that right there. Crafting table, get all the essentials out. Out and about. Alright, there we go. And, ooh, oh yeah, we got blast furnaces, I forgot about those. Uh, oh yeah, we'll pop the bed down. Uh, so I'll just pop him like that. Easy. And we'll just chuck everything in there for now. We can do organising uh, a lot later. Uh, if you watched any of my other videos, organising is not some of my forte. <laughs> that I have done in the past, but we'll make a conscious effort to do so in this this series. Uh, make, maybe even make a storage unit or something like that. Uh, so let's go back, let's grab uh, another chest, or maybe at least a few more items from a chest. I'm not sure if we'll be able to... Oh. Yeah, we might... Oh, okay, you know what? I will just pop that fish. If I pop that fish away, then... I'll be able to. I'll be able to carry the entire chest. There we go. So I'll pop that there. Make our way back and do a few more rounds. All right, second chest is placed. Pop all this stuff in there. There we go. All right, we're almost done. I might just. Quickly you can go to sleep. Alright, and grab that next chest. Alright, we've got our little trusty starter 
<laughs> a little trusty starter, um, what should we call it, barrel that we have. Alright, pop all this stuff in there. There we go, we got one chest left. Well, we say goodbye to this beginning cave. It was good for our little starter base. But now we move on to better and greater things. Clear up this, our starting farm, put that there. And we move on to our next adventure. There we go. And this is the last chest done. And we have officially moved everything out of the cave. It's uh, quite cool stuff, pretty surreal, really. Uh, out of the cave, we're going to build our house here. I'm thinking uh, if we build our house maybe just here, because I like this little inlet here. I like how it has like this little space in between. We can make like a little road or something that goes out from our house. Just have it have it starting off here, and then we we'll go from there. So and maybe build up, build upon it, build some more stuff around than we need. We'll see. We'll see how we do. We we'll see how we do. But I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I'm liking what we're doing. It's very good. I'm thinking we're needing a lot more uh, spruce wood <laughs> if we're going to be doing this. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll see how we go. We need more spruce and more oak. Luckily, we've got plenty of oak near us. The spruce is all the way on the other side, but um, we can just make more. If we, we've killed enough bone, we've got enough bones to just do some bone meal and do it that way. All right, let's do that. We could pop those two in there. We don't need that. Don't need that. Oh, actually, we might need torches. Did I bring any other torches? I didn't. Okay, so I'll just have to make some. We have any leftover charcoal? Yeah, we do have left up the charcoal. All right, we'll use up the charcoal. There we go. We just light up this area. Just around here. So nothing spawns in our immediate area. That'll do for now. And then we can move on to building. So let's do that, shall we? guys so uh we've decided to do uh this instead of what i was originally uh planning to do i was planning on just building a a house just here but then i realized uh, i don't have all the materials of what i would like to do with this space so i figured well let's build a little hobbit hole kind of a of a deal here just into this little mountain mountainous slope uh, and eventually we can build like a better, like a better house area. Or well, this might even become a house, you know, we I mean, never know. We might, be, might become attached to this. Uh, but I was thinking maybe even at a later date, this could become a storage house or something like, you know, a massive storage room kind of a deal. And then we have our house here, it, which is probably what we'll do. We'll probably do it like that, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll do a few things and we'll go from there. So 
I've only done the exterior. I haven't done any inside. This this is the house currently. It's uh, amazing. Uh, it's the best house I built. <laughs> uh, I need glass or glass panes uh, to do those. But um, yeah. Honestly, if it was me, I would probably do this uh, dark wood or dark dark oak wood, and then this the spruce. But you know, we haven't found any dark oak yet. Yet. So that might change, maybe. Uh, it's a bit of work to change it all, but mm. <laughs> mm. probably, probably not. Uh, but we'll we'll keep it as it is. I like the exterior of where we're going with this, so we'll start doing the inside. I'll just build out a a small little uh, spot in there, uh, just to match uh, these two sort of window areas and. Uh, I'll, I'll have to fix up like this bit, like the the side. So I'll just have it join up to the top of the roof and maybe do a bit of terraforming of it, but not too much. I don't want to do too much, just, just a little bit, a little bit. But anyway, uh, let's start doing the inside now. Okay, so I was just about to grab some oak wood and I got this enderman here. And I got <laughs> all these pillagers aiming at me, which is not great. Okay. Can I... Okay, so the enderman's gone up there. Let's see if I can... Get around these guys. Alright, so I've taken out two. One's stuck in a tree. Oh! Voluntary exile. We just got an advancement. Kill a raid captain. Maybe consider staying away from villages for the time being. Oh, yeah, because we got bad omen. Let's take on the raid. Let's do it. Do it. Why not? Why not, I say? I'll probably be severely outclassed, but it will be all right, I think. <laughs> Okay, let's uh, just make a double chest filled with stuff. We'll pop it over here. I brought, I brought, it, I'm bringing a sword just in case, so I can just kind of like double, double it. All right, raid is starting. I wonder if they'll spawn like beyond the barrier. That's a thing. 
Let's uh, press the thing. Yep. All right, where are they? Oh, there they are. All right, all the crossbow peeps. Alright, got him. There's another one behind me. Alright, there we go. First round, easy peasy. Alright, he's spamming that bell. <laughs> they spawn back up there i wish i had a bow a bow would be really handy in this okay where are they going vindicators up there are they gonna fall oh my god they do Come on, let's make him fall. <laughs> he hit himself. Alright, can we get him to fall? Go on. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. A day. He's not. He's not gonna fall. What's the iron golems doing? Go on. Iron. Go on, help out. What's she doing for? Chilling here. Ooh, don't go in the lava. Last thing we want to be doing now. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just realized I got a crossbow now. There's two enemies remaining. Where'd he go? Oh, he's stuck. That works. <laughs> Grab that. Where's that other one? He's over here. Is he? Where is he? Is he in the cave? I can't tell. I'm gonna have to free camp. Where is he? Is he in the cave? Oh my god, he is. He's stuck in the cave. Uh, okay. This is interesting. Oh, and he went down further. That cat here. Go on. Shoot. Mad aim. I am the best. Right, okay. Now I have to unstuck myself. Oh yeah, the border exported. Uh, not exported. <laughs> it's not a PDF file. Uh, it expanded. So where did, where, did, where are they? Where are they? Where do they go? Are they here? There's a villager. Oh, there they are. Surely the iron golem is doing work. Go on, do something. Oh my god, it's a ravager. Oh, he's been taking him out. Oh, nice work. Oh, we got here in the village. Oh, class. Thanking you. There's fireworks. <laughs> Anything going for two emeralds? <laughs> Oh, he's here. What's up, mate? Hey, get back here. Let's do that. Boom. What a deal. 
Alright, get back in your house. Nice. You stay in there. And yeah, no one in there. Okay. Nice. So we've just got three we've got three advancements there. So we did the voluntary exile, we've done the hero of the village, and we've done what a deal. Nice. Didn't expect to do those, but you know. When in Rome. Oh, we got a saddle. Oh, our saddle was clutch. We can do quite a bit with a saddle, so that's really good. Glad we got that. Don't have to go to a dungeon and try and find one there. Uh, crossbow, that is also very good. You can get a few achievements with that. Uh, I'll keep those on me for now. Uh, we might just pop the shield, extra shield and axe in there. Didn't actually need them. I overprepared. Uh, okay. Let's just grab these. Grab the sticks. Got torches now. Right, surely it links up with this, right? Yep. Alright, cool. Now, let's just light up this whole area. So now I don't have to deal with monsters spawning in here. And I don't really want to be filling this whole thing up, so... Win-win. Alright, there we go. Nice. Now we got Hero of the Village instead of Bad Omen. It also doesn't have a time on it, which is slightly scary. Uh, like, I don't, I don't know what that means. <laughs> the no, no time limit on it? Hmm. Not sure. I, I'm not. I'm not sure what that means. But we'll see. I think they usually go for what, like thirty minutes or something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't really do villager trading all too much, so it's a little bit new to me. Anyway, let's continue building. Hey guys, so we finished up with the house now, well, and I'm not going to lie, I quite like it with what we've done. So I'm thinking, uh, since we've done with this, I don't, I'm not sure if I should be building a new house, because I, I quite like what we've done, you know. Uh, we've got some storage for chests, I haven't put it, I haven't sorted out the chests yet, everything is kind of still out there. Uh, but I was thinking, uh, enchanting room here, so we'll have an enchantment table there, put the bookshelves all the way to the top and stuff like that. And I was thinking of moving the portal over here, make a giant portal here, and, and I might add like, um, uh, I'll probably add a fence a fence gate or some fence gates something like here just in case you know just so piglins don't get in uh then i've also got my bed to move my bed in i got uh blast furnaces uh, smokers crafting tables and if you go up here uh we've got the normal furnaces just by themselves plus uh some uh barrels just for some quick storage uh, I was thinking of putting like an armor stand here and then putting that iron armor that we have and just popping it there. Just, you know, make use of everything that we've got. Uh, and for these little tiny part, 
it. Uh, it can be used for more chests if need be, but I was also thinking uh, maybe for a section like here, we could have like these two uh, be for uh, lava, lava pockets. So we just have uh, cauldrons uh, filled with uh, lava. Oh, you know, the re renewable lava sources, and I can then use them for all of these blast furnaces as well, uh, and smokers and all that. Uh, but also I could use it for other stuff, should I need it as well. I was thinking another one for like brewing stands and stuff like that, you know, for uh, potion making, because we've got to do some potions, we've got to do potions. Uh, and... That should be it. If we, if we need if needs be, we might have some more storage, you know, that we can use. And I might, uh, I might do some more decorations, you know. I might use put some wool down or something like that. Uh, or I don't know. I, I tried to just do uh, the basics, basically, get it ready. Uh, and I might add some, you know, item frames or something to to these, so I know what's what when I'm putting them in. Oh, maybe not. I mean. Uh, I'll get used to it. Uh, I guess I'll get used to it as time goes on. Uh, probably don't think we have enough time to in this video to uh, do the uh, the inside of uh, the nether of the uh, uh, you know. Oh God, I can't even words today. Uh, fortressing the other side of the uh, nether portal so that. Uh, ghasts don't immediately kill us. I am nervous uh, for doing the uh, the other side. Huh? Hello. Hello. I, I am nervous of doing the other side of the uh, huh? of the nether portal just because if I move it over there, it's probably going to be in a lava lake, uh -huh. which kind of sucks. But you know, we might be able to move past that. Uh -huh. Um, nothing in particular that I need from this guy. Huh. Yeah, yeah, I haven't got much, mate. Don't need it. Don't need anything from you. Uh, I might just quickly. Oh yeah, and I have a ton of cobblestone from mining out this thing. <laughs> so we're not we're not going to be low on cobblestone for a very long time. Uh, I'll just re put all this stuff here. Also, while I'm doing these videos, do let me know uh, just ideas of things that I can do to add to the to my experience or what buildings I should build next. Because there's a lot of things I could do in this like little area here. Not sure what to go about first. I know there's a few like um, farms that I would like to do, like an iron farm. An iron farm is probably something I shouldn't be working on because... What I don't want to happen, even though we're in the large space, and if we keep on getting uh, more and more uh, advancements, which should be all right, I don't want to run out. <laughs> so we've got to basically make sure that we've got a heap of staff. And iron is a must-need resource in any gameplay. That we're playing for Minecraft, so uh, that will probably be something that I got to work on. All right, this should be good. All right, nice. That looks better, and that will slowly turn into grass blocks. So all right, and I'll. Oh, I'll just grab another bit of dirt. Another thing that we've collected a lot of and just finish off this little tiny bit here. Nice. All right. And is there anything seen? Uh, there is a little bit over here. All right. Let's fix that. And that should be done. There we go. Nice. Looking good. All right. I'm quite happy with what we've done here. Might do a little bit more terraforming out at the front there and do some other stuff. But for now, I think this is a pretty good starter starter base. We've got pretty much everything that we need. We've, yeah, and we've got plans for other stuff. 
So I'm not sure we need anything else, but do let me know down in the comments section uh, if there is anything I should probably add or if something you want to see me do, like around here. Uh, otherwise, I'm pretty sure that's it. So be sure to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you all guys in the next one. Goodbye.